Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So tonight I'm going to be showing you my evening routine with Lilith. She is eight months old and this is just our solo night routine uh, for the nights where Dan's at work. So we normally start off just doing dinner. This varies in time. It really does depend on whenever she takes her nap and has her lunch and stuff like that. She doesn't have a solid structured routine um, but our night does seem to start whenever we start to have dinner. So after she's had dinner and I, I like to give her a bit of finger food just so she can have, have a play with it mostly. Um, and this is when I seem to get a lot of the bottles and I try and keep on top of many things in the kitchen just before we kind of chill out and have an evening to ourselves. So here you can see me washing the bottles, getting them ready to be sterilized. So once that is done, Lilith was already in the front room by now. Um, I just walk in and go join in with whatever she's doing. And here you can see she's pulling up my rug and making a mess of things. But we just then like to have a play. We like to just sit down and chill and just do mother baby things. We just have a good time after dinner. As you can see, she's very interested by the camera and just snatching and grabbing things from me. Um, but all babies do that, right? just had to interrupt the video and just let you all hear her laugh because it's honestly one of the most soothing things for me to hear. Uh, once we've finished having a laugh we just get our bum done, get ready for bed, get changed, get washed and you can see she's in one of her mini club outfits and I'm just moving everything where it needs to be put so washing in the laundry basket, nappy in the bed. So then this is the time where I like to just get her bottle prepared for bed. Um, at this point we had spent a few hours together on the floor and it was just coming up to her bedtime already. So I'm just preparing her bottle for her. So tonight I took the bottle into the front room, I sat down and I think I watched EastEnders um, and I just gave her, her the bottle and she fell asleep in my arms which is just so precious and it doesn't happen too often so I'm just making the most of the cuddles I get. She's just oh, she's such a cute baby, I love her. We then go upstairs, she's in her big girl room, in her big girl bed and I put her down to bed and this is where I just make sure everything's fine, everything's accessible to her. Um, I cover her with a blanket, she sleeps with a sleeping bag and a blanket. I don't like duvets but it's definitely too cold not to worry about a blanket, like I have to put the blanket on her. Um, and then this is where I draw the curtains and just make sure I've got her camera and stuff just all situated in the right place, ready for when the lights go off and I leave the room. Once she's in bed and she's all settled, I do like to get back into the kitchen and I've also done the front room prior to this and just really tidy up and sort out all the mess or at least the majority of the mess um, that is still left to be tidied and I do spend a solid 45 minutes trying to just tidy up everything from the day. I'm not very good at keeping on top of tidying, I tend to just have to block out chunks of time to tidy up. Um, but yeah, this is what I'm doing, I'm just organising and tidying my kitchen. I really do love to just spray my sides down with the flora of the evening, 
So make sure I've got rid of all the bacteria that's just harboring on the sides. If I go to sleep and they're left all messy and disorganised, it really does make me just feel really gross in the morning. I then put a wash on. I say I put it on, I fill the washing machine up and I put it on a delay so it spins about an hour before I wake up in the morning just so then I can move it to the tumble dryer or do whatever I've got to do with all the wet washing. Um, but yeah, I make sure that's all loaded up before bed and I'd say a solid 80% of the time it's always Lilith's clothes. If it's not Lilith's clothes, it's Dan's work stuff. Um, at this point so I was using my um, instant pump to actually figure out what the time was and how long of a delay I needed to put that's done I switched the light off in the kitchen I then forgot that I had to come back in to close the blinds um, but the blinds always get closed in the evening as well um, here you can just see me giving Dan a message to make sure that work was going okay for him um, but yeah that's everything for this video if you've enjoyed be sure to subscribe and leave a comment down below I really hope to see you all in my next video bye guys